Oh, uh, hey, I, uh, need you to do a little recon for me. Last night, the feds impounded Frank's chopper for, uh, legal reasons. Nothing serious, don't worry. I'm not. Thing is, there are a few items on the chopper that Frank would prefer not to get into the wrong hands. Hopefully, they haven't had a chance to search the boy. What am I looking for? A USB thing. It's under the passenger side seat, I think. Does Frank know about this job? Maybe he does, and maybe he doesn't. The important thing to remember here is that if you don't get back that thing, you're like dead and stuff. Anything else? That's all. <laughs> You'd be surprised what those little things can store. I mean, hundreds of photos. Just call me when you get back from the airport. So now I gotta clean up the goons' messes too. Great. I just couldn't take another bite. Was your afternoon on the yard ruined by reporting horrifying women? Bring me to the factory. That's right. Oi, oi, you're back with your main mate, Billy Castle, on the Duke Factory 92.2. Let's take some calls from our listeners, shall we? Hello, Lydia. Am I speaking with you and Mr. Castle today? One and only chap, what's putting the whoop in your door this morning, guy? Right. My name is Chester Harrington. I've been trying to contact you for weeks, but you've been avoiding my call. I'm representing two dozen women in a class action lawsuit against you for a mentally statutory rape and over $130,000 of unpaid child support. Mr. Castle? Uh, uh, Mr. Castle, you can step out for two shakes of a last and give you a ring as soon as he steps back in, dearie. Oh, bollocks. Um, we'll be back in a moment. Billy Castle here, and you're in the Duke Factory. Bigger it's high time we hit the phones again. Murdoch, you're on the air with the Duke of Duke, Billy Castle. Oh, my God, oh, my God, I can't even talk to you. Believe it, mate. I listen to your show every day, because you have the cutest accent and the best music. Flatter me so much. I'm a touch bashful, you know. Tell me about you. Well, um, I just started 10th grade and I'm already the starting center on my baby volleyball team. That's dandy. Tell me, would you describe yourself as a ticklish person? Um, I guess so. Smashing. Let me transfer you to a private line and we'll get to know each other better. We've got more great stuff coming at you in the Duke Factory. Don't touch that. A little recon, huh? Hey, are you the forensics guy we're waiting on? No time to search the thing. This is 92.2, the Duke Factory. We're up next is back to the like a soldier. Check it out.
I thought security was messing with me when they told me you were coming in for a landing. Way to go above and beyond. I don't think the Fed's got a chance to search her. That thing's probably where you left it. Man, this is good. Real good. Yeah, well, I'd get this bird out of plain sight if I were you, and maybe a new paint job. Good idea. 